Hey guys, I wanted to come to you today and let you know an update on my hair. It is just marvelous. Um, it is a quick weave, so I'm going to show you guys that I have been able to wear it up. I have paper under here, so it won't get under my hair with the glue. So, I mean, don't mind that. But, yeah, so I can wear it up, you know, whatever. And then down. And it is getting better as it gets older, of course. I don't want to take it out. I believe it's mine now. So, you know, right now I'm just enjoying this hair. It was not expensive at all. Once again, um, I'm supposed to be posting a slideshow of how I did the hairstyle. So I will do that soon because I had to re-upload my PowerPoint. So I wasn't able to put the slideshow together because um, my PowerPoint got outdated. So I just updated it and I'm going to have to make that slideshow for you guys because I have the pictures sent to my email already and I'm just waiting to put it all on my PowerPoint and make a video of it so be looking for that it'll be here soon um, this is the equal hair and Vogue curl if that's right I think it's Vogue curl but it might be beach curl I think it's beach curl no it's Vogue curl it's one of them. I'm not sure, but I'm going to have to look at the um, pictures and let you know for sure. But it's one of those. So, I mean, you can use whatever kind of curly hair you want to use. But I just really like this hair for people that aren't, um like, really into buying all the expensive, expensive hair. This is some really good hair for cheap if you just want something for, you know, a minute. And it's actually lasting me longer than I thought. So I might just invest and do it all over again and maybe just switch the colors up and see how I like it. But I really like this because it has the blondes and the browns and the darker browns all together like I like it. So I just love it. It came out great. And it was like it's sort of an invisible part. It's the invisible parts that you would see on a mannequin when you go in a beauty supply store. It's not the regular invisible part where you lay the track sideways and go up. So I'm going to have to show you on that picture slide how I laid those tracks because I do believe I took pictures of that part to make sure you guys could see the steps I took. So I hope you guys like my hair. I'm going to give a twirl. And proud to me even getting this in all, um, doing it. I had those gold curls in. So I was digging the curls for a while, but I'm loving it longer. So... I'm going to turn around so you guys can see. And it's pretty and it's soft. And the only thing I do at night to take care of it, I just twist it like this and put my bun in on. And in the morning, I just take it off and shake it and just run my fingers through it. And try to make sure you go underneath the hair and like anything that's tangled untangle it because you don't want the hair underneath to be matted and what I do like as for the care regimen for the day as the day goes on and I'm actually going out and about from going somewhere I just get my hands and I just totally wet it or use a spray bottle I just scrunch and wet scrunch and wet it with water all over and then I get whatever kind of conditioner of choice or whatever. Or you could use mousse, whatever you want to use to keep those curls looking moist. Because you don't want it to start looking dry. But even without product on it, I notice it is shiny, but it's not like a fake shiny. It's like a good shiny. So, however you like it, it is definitely gonna last me a minute I really like it and it makes me remember when I used to wear my hair like this a long time ago and when I used to wear color because I'm such a 1B girl now so having the color for the spring summer is refreshing 
and I like it so I hope this video helps someone who doesn't want to spend a lot of money on some hair to kind of get an idea of like what this hair looks like it's really some pretty good hair the curls are not so defined it's like some of them are loose some of them are tight some so it really looks like I mean, of course, it's weave when it's this big, but it really looks natural when the curls are like different rather than them all being the same exact curl. It's like some are loose, like real hair. When you wash your real hair and you're natural, some of your curls are tight, some are loose. So I think this looks really good. Like when it's wet, you'll see what I'm saying. And um, because some of the curls fail, like in the actual packaging. So I was like, oh, good. That's going to help it to look, you know, more realistic. But since I wanted it so big, I actually used like two and a half packs. And for a normal person, they would use like two packs. Some people use three, which I, I almost did because my whip, the whips are thin. So I used more hair than I would have thought I was going to use. But I'm just glad I bought three packs and all to make sure I had enough. So if you want it big and like my hair um i recommend maybe you get three packs but you know for the average person you only need two but my head is big and <laughs> my hair is thick so i just was like oh no i'm not gonna try that so this is the look i have so i hope it helps someone out and i hope you liked it bye